Hello everybody and welcome to this month's uh, book haul. I forgot to film an intro, so this is the intro. As you can see, I'm getting ready to move house. Dane reads. Hello everybody, uh, I got a book in the post today, uh, well actually the other day, but I'm about to start reading it, so I thought I'd better haul it before I forget. It is God Emperor of June by Frank Herbert, so I'm continuing along with the June series. And this is where I'm up to, so this one, this one next. Hello, I have a lot of books to haul for you today, including what I'm currently reading, which is Chapter House Dune by Frank Herbert. This is the sixth and final book in the Dune series, at least as far as was written by Frank Herbert. There are then more in, I think it's called like Dune Legends or something, I don't know, I've just accidentally removed one of my tabs. Um, yeah, I've been enjoying reading the Dune books so far, so I'm currently reading this one. I'm going to pop this back down so I don't lose my page. Speaking of not losing my page, we have Asterix et les Normands, uh, which is by Argus and EA So this is an Asterix BD, Bon Dessinaire, graphic novel in French. And I've been reading this in my bedtime book, so I'm about halfway through. It's got the Normans in it. Very good. My granddad's called Norman. And then these other ones to haul, uh, these are all ones that I've read as well. So we have William Shakespeare's The Clone Army Attacketh by Ian Dersher. So this is in his series of... Um, Star Wars in the form of William Shakespeare plays basically, a lot of fun, would recommend. Uh, Reality Sandwiches by Allen Ginsberg, which is some Ginsberg poetry. And then uh, Five Go Bump in the Night, which is one of the Enid Blight and Famous Five Books for Grown Ups by Bruno Vincent. So as I say, uh, all of these I have read and I'll be doing reviews of each of them, so keep your eyes peeled. Hello everybody, I've got some books to talk to you about. Uh, the first is The Fall by Albert Camus, so this is literally the book I'm currently reading. Um, I have La Chute, which is the uh, French like original text of it as well. So I'm going to read it in English first, just so that I can understand it a bit better. This is highly annotated as well by the person who owned it before. So that's very cool. Uh, I've read the introduction and that's where I got to, so now I need to read the main book. Um, but yeah, I also won on eBay a job lot of Michael Crichton books. So there were five of them and I paid about eight quid. So uh, I got a Rising Sun. Next. Congo. Sphere. And then of course Jurassic Park, which I've already read. So this one will go straight on eBay. The others go straight on my uh, to be read list. Hello everybody, sorry about the light from the window. All I can really do is try and keep in the way of it. Um, I mean, I guess I could I could try and rotate. Let's try and rotate. No, I just don't, yeah. I don't really have a decent backdrop at the moment because I'm still in the process of moving house. Um, and I also don't have curtains up there because those are down so that I can wash them in the new house because my uh, washing machine here doesn't work. But anyway, in the post today, I got some books. It was a James Herbert job lot on eBay. So I got The Survivor, uh, which I am going to give to my friend Sabrina because she's been reading some James Herbert and she doesn't have this one. Uh, and I've already read this one. So otherwise it would just be going on my eBay. So I'm going to give that to her. And then, um, yeah, I think she's going to give me some of the ones that she's got, which I don't have. Uh, the other ones I got, I got The Dark, Portent, is that how you say it? Portent? If, if this was French, it would be Portent. And there... Is this... What the fuck? I think this isn't supposed to come out. I think that's meant to stay there like that, and then you open it up, and then it's got that, but I just opened them. <laughs> anyway. Wow, okay. So it's like a 3D book, so you can, you know, be like this. Hi, everybody. Um, what else is there? Ash. This is a big old book. Oh, and quite small print as well. 670 odd pages in that one. Uh, and then this one, which is Ghosts of... The Ghosts of Sleeth? Or Ghosts of the Sleeth? I'm not really sure, based on the layout that they've used on this. The Ghosts of Sleeth. Yeah. It's just the way it's designed, it doesn't make it very clear. Uh, and 48, so this is two books in one. So yes, I'll be reading these soon and letting you know what I think. Alright, well as you can see, I'm in the new house, just chilling and whatnot. Um, that's it, That's all. those are all the books that I received in uh, September. I have already hauled some for October, so keep your eyes peeled for that. But in the meantime, thanks as always for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button if you've enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments if you've read any of these books and if so, what you thought of them. Hit that subscribe button for more and I will see you soon for another bookish video. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.